You know, we're a young squad against a, a pretty seasoned Luton side, and uh, yeah, in the end, it's actually it was a small, small detail, if you like, that, that kind of cost us. Yeah, it was. Um, I thought we had more than enough to go on and win the game. Um, we were pushing them right at the end, um, and it just unfortunately didn't have enough to go on and get the goal. And I thought if we were to get that goal, I'd back ourselves to go on and, and uh, continue to get the second, but it didn't quite come. Um, yeah. I think there's a lot of young boys out there tonight, um, and you're playing alongside uh, you know, Tom Mack in centre half, got Luke Southwood behind you. You know, there's a load of players who've kind of come through the system. Boys, you've probably played with the youth levels a lot, you know, many years ago. So um, it's, it's sort of you know a really good thing, despite the result, to kind of get out there with those guys tonight. Yeah, definitely. Um, didn't really think about it too much when I was out there. It's just just another game, really, and. Uh, no, it was, uh, it's a bit, it was a really good day for the academy. Um, a couple of couple of debuts in there, which is which is which is good. Um, and I thought I thought we all we all did our bit. We all um, applied ourselves well, um, but unfortunately didn't have quite enough. Yeah, and I think the fact is, you know, as you say, we were playing against some uh, as well as we said seasoned players in, in Luton who uh, certainly made it hard work. And that's probably, as you say, what what the that the detail kind of uh, ended up. Swing of the match, really. Yeah, there were a couple of times in the, in the second half where I think um, our lack of experience, like, really showed, um, and their tactical now like uh, came came through. Um, a couple of silly fouls, a couple of sloppy passes that we gave away at crucial moments. Um, but that's that's to be expected when you when you make uh, eleven changes and, and you have the youngsters in, as you, as you say. But um, it's definitely something that we'll learn from. Um, just a, it's just a tricky one because we were looking forward to that United game. Um, the game's coming thick and fast, so there would have been opportunities there for for the eleven, or well, the, the boys that are, that are fighting for places. Um, so yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a difficult one to take. On a personal level too, though, you've uh, you've been involved in a, in a couple of games now. Came off the bench against Derby and you know helped us sort of see that through. And, and 90 minutes tonight, so yeah, in some senses, it's you kind of like your um, sort of new chapter for you in some senses. Well, yeah, I've, uh, I've had a couple of, uh, you could say, tricky seasons, but I've, I've stuck at it. Um, I was fortunate enough to have, to, to have a duration of my contract, which allowed me to, to have those couple of seasons. And um, I've come back now, I've come back into the fold, um, and I'm just taking each day as it comes. I'm loving, loving being back training and um, learning off Liam and Mauro, um, really, really leading by example. Um, and yeah, uh, long may it continue, and we'll, we'll see, we'll see what happens by the end of the transfer window, but um, yeah, this, this is where I want to be. Um, and yeah, you have taken each day as it comes. Yeah, so I mean, on, the, on those points, thinking about what goes on at the training grounds, if you've got those two experienced players, you know, they're good eggs as well, aren't they? They're guys who will help you. They're not, they're not even though they're, you try to get into their shoes, I'm sure they'll kind of let you get as close as they can by helping you out on the training ground. Yeah, yeah, definitely. There's no, uh, there's no bad blood there. It's, it's, uh, they're trying to raise the, raise the level of, of training and raise the level of the competition because um, it's only going to improve them and, and improve us, which is, which is ultimately what, what, what you want in a team. Um, and yeah, I'm, I'm enjoying that. I'm relishing the, uh, the challenge. And since your kind of debut a couple of years back, without the sort of managers come and gone, how how you find the new manager? How's Paolo since uh, since he's come in? Yeah, he's been he's been really good. Um, I like I really like his style, and you could see from today's game, he, he wants he wants defenders that are comfortable on the ball and and, and want to um, keep possession of the ball and not not force things. And it, it took a, a couple of moments where maybe I, I could have. Um, uh, maybe take that on board a bit more, but that, that will come with um, with time and time under working with, with him. Yeah. And lastly, yeah, we've got a game at the weekend to look forward to, so I'm sure all the team will be back out, probably a stronger eleven if you like, a sort of first choice, and, and looking to kind of continue the, the good start in the, in the league because it was a yeah, perfect perfect start, wasn't it, against Derby? Yeah, the uh, the mood in the dressing room was 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 awesome at the uh, at the end of that game on the, on Saturday against Derby. So. Um, Long, long may that continue. Yeah, we'll go on to Saturday and yeah, yeah, long may it continue, as I said.